How to install stop valves for sinks and other fixtures. Sharkbite stop valves are designed for quick and easy installation of fixtures and appliances, such as faucets, toilets, refrigerators, dishwashers, ice makers, and humidifiers. Let's see how easy it is to install a stop valve for a faucet and toilet supply connection. If you are installing a toilet, only one stop valve is needed. If you are installing a faucet, two stop valves will be needed. Identify the type of stub out at your install location. If your stub out comes out of the wall, you will need an angle stop valve. If your stub out comes out of the floor, you will need a straight stop valve. If you need to cut your pipe, cut as cleanly and squarely as possible. Make sure to leave a minimum of one inch of pipe to insert the shark bite stop valve onto the stub out. Be sure the pipe is free of scratches and debris. If you're handling copper pipe, remove any sharp edges or burrs. Next, use your shark bite depth and deburr tool to measure and mark the insertion depth on your pipe stub out. You can find the insertion depth chart on sharkbite.com. Push the stop valve to the insertion mark you just made on the pipe. If installing a faucet, repeat steps for the second stop valve. Sharkbite stop valves are available with a variety of supply connections. Plumbing tape is not needed for the threaded connections. The first option is a braided supply line that threads onto the stop valve and to the fixture. The second option utilizes PEX tubing and Sharkbite fixture connectors. Thread the connector onto the fixture. Measure the distance between the two connectors and add two inches. Transfer this measurement to the PEX tubing and cut to length. Push the tubing into the stop valve and fixture connector. A third option offered is a stop valve with an integrated supply connector. Now turn on your water and check the connection. Using Shark Bite is fast, efficient, and reliable.